Okay, guys, hey. Just gonna talk about the TF2 economy with the key prices rising and buds dropping, and why I suspect it's happening, and maybe a way the community can fix it as a whole, but I find that unlikely. What I'm thinking about the keys is ever since they introduced the Steam market, new keys haven't been been put into circulation. Old keys are just being resold. People buy them in the game for their metal they get, then they resell them and buy Steam games. As opposed to buying them in a market and having two keys in existence instead of one that someone sold and then someone rebought on the market for 20 cents cheaper. So there's not as many keys going into circulation as before. Granted, key prices will always be rising, but they're rising at a much faster rate right now because of this. And I fear what could happen if they continue rising. So, that's why they're going to keep rising. I'm, I have no idea when they're going to stop rising, so don't even bother asking. Uh, all I have to say is boycott Steam Store. That's, I, I, don't, I don't usually buy keys. I usually trade up to them. But if you are going to buy keys, please buy them in-game for the greater good of the economy. Um, I'm just going to talk about some buds. So, buds are tied in with the keys. Buds are not a price in correlation. Keys don't. Keys determine everything, for the most part. So the buds are relevant to keys. So since keys are drop are raising in value, that means their dollar value is all is raising too. Like it's not going to go above 250, but in the steams, but selling them on PayPal, it'll go up, and that so refined value is dropping. So buds are. I uh, someone explained to me this this earlier. It's confusing. So when key value rises, bud value drops. So unless keys start to go back down, buds are going to continue dropping and in, in. I, I have a feeling buds aren't going to go anywhere below 20. I, I'm just hoping they aren't because I love buds. They're a great currency. 24, I think, would be a good price for them. I That's like right above, I mean below what they are right now. So all about that. And it's... Gonna okay, guys, sorry for that. My mic cut out. So, it's gonna lower the... Unusuals are gonna become lower in value because of this. Since buds are dropping, either people are gonna start charging more buds for unusuals, which I... It could... It's Theoretically, it's possible, but I don't, I don't see that happening. I see the value of unusuals as a whole going down. It's just... This whole community market thing is, is not helping TF2. I hope Valve will shut this down. I hope you guys... When people say it's because of the idlers in TF2, it's not because of idlers why the, the price is going up. There have been idlers since the beginning of hats, basically. And keys have only gone up about a refined since then, and that's been a, a long time. And that's just because there's been a lot more TF2 players trading. There's always going to be a high demand for keys since so supply and demand, we're going to have a higher refined price since that's what everyone can get. So, but it's it's not. It, I'm just gonna say again. Why is it's not because of the idlers? There's always idlers. There's like always a steady inflow of keys and metal, and that's usually about the same. But since there's the Steam Community Store, that's been thrown off, and the economy's suffering from it. Well, guys, this is the very first TF2 economy report. Hope you guys like it. Subscribe, rate, comment. To like the video, uh, leave your opinion in ch uh, comments. Thanks for listening. Bye, guys.